lashes. I'm about to dye my eyelashes. This is, I'm not wearing any makeup. How crazy is that? I've been getting a lot of questions about my job or whatever. A little pre-workout snack. I'm going to be sending out a woman study Bible every video. Good morning, guys. 6.30 in the morning. I'm gonna take you guys along with me for a day in my life. I usually do like a couple days in my life, but I was like, you know what? We're just gonna do like a random day in my life. And my days are so all over the place and there's nothing really scheduled. Um, I typically have like a morning routine where I go to the gym, I go on a walk, I read my Bible, stuff like that. But the rest of the day is usually just chaos. And this is like my sewing machine. Um, it's an air purifier. It's like the perfect noise and I'll link it in my description But if you're looking for like an air purifier and like a nice white noise, it's perfect First thing I want to do is make some tea and then I'm gonna go read Put the heat on to 65. Look how cute this little mug is. My brother got me this mug and I think it's so cute. The tea brand. Tezo. I love this brand. I always use two packets. If you're new here, I've been doing these heatless unicorn curls with this little rod thing I got from Walmart. Whenever I wash my hair, I now put it in these little heatless curls because it doesn't get all frizzy and everything like that. I showered last night and I'm going to show you guys what I use. I rosemary shampoo and conditioner. It was kind of like a hype a couple years ago on TikTok and I was like, oh, let me try it because like my hair needs something. And I was using the Balayage, I think, shampoo and conditioner and it's just too expensive. And it worked good, but this, my hair stylist said that my hair has gotten so healthy just after like a couple months of using it. Um, I'll link all this stuff like in an Amazon thing so you guys can have easy access to it. This is the satin bonnet I use. It's also from Amazon. We're going to go have tea. Read before we go on our walk. Tea is done. Collagen. Because we got to stay looking young and fresh and hip. And then that will just melt in my tea. Work word to the big bird. Like you don't feel as scared when you live in an apartment because you hear everyone. And then like, I know people here are not cray cray. Like my last apartment, my last apartment, a man, um, I lived on the second story and a man put his, put the ladder up on the rail thing and climbed up there on my balcony. Two men banging on my back door. And I called my aunt and she's like, what are you doing? Like I was hiding in the bathroom. I was like, 20 at this time and they kept saying they were the maintenance workers and I'm like no those were two Hispanic men the maintenance worker is a white man with a ponytail there was only one maintenance guy um and so I don't know who they were I don't know what they were doing there anyways I'll go now so if you've made it this far in the video by the grace of God I'm gonna be sending out a woman's study Bible every video I have an NIV women's study Bible it has devotionals in it it has like the study part at the bottom only requirements is comment me something good that god has done in your life or is doing in your life and make sure you're following me on instagram because i'm gonna announce it on there and i have to be able to message you to um send it to you I just can't send them out of the united states just yet mainly because um the last person i did it was almost 400 dollars. now i'm gonna start with just the united states and we're gonna do one bible every video it's kind of chilly out right now so i'm gonna go on a little walk so here is the fit a little bit of water and sea salt Celtic sea salt has like all the minerals you need I put a little pinch of that in also I am starving sure a little pinch oh, but too much I might eat a little snacky snack I have a little vegan protein bar um got these at Costco a couple weeks ago they're good like these little rice crispy things, but there's 15 grams of protein in them. 
I decided to take a like a little jog. I'm not doing that anymore. Cause the gnat just flew my eyeball and it took me like and it was just stuck in there. So. Back from my walk. I did three and a half miles. Um, my allergies started acting up, so my eyes are itching really bad, so I had to come back home. But I'm gonna go to the gym now. I made a little pre-workout snack. I've been on an English muffin cake. I just put jelly, grape jelly, and some Kerrygold butter. So good. Here is the fit. I'm just, I don't know. I guess I'm looking like Halloween today. I actually am gonna bring you guys along with me just cause I'm trying to implement more of my like workout routines because I know some of you just don't know where to start so I'm gonna show you what I do stuff like that. I don't need too much caffeine so I'm probably just gonna do three-fourths a scoop of my pre-workout. I will see you guys in the gym. All done with my workout my face is a little blotchy because i wasn't gonna do like anything like high intensity but i decided that i was gonna do just 20 minutes of stair um i do try to do two high intensity cardio days so uh yeah and i kind of count that as like two miles because the amount of work it is look a little rough anyways i'm catering my childhood friends wedding this weekend so i'm gonna go ahead and kind of just plan everything i need to get this is my first wedding i'm catering for i usually do like baby showers and like little parties and stuff like that but yeah i want to make sure this is super special for her i'm getting a lot of questions about my job or whatever just so you guys know if you're new here i worked in factory for since i was 18 and then i started a server job at texas roadhouse and then that's kind of when like i was also doing social media just for fun and then the lord blessed it like financially um, through brand deals and just like partnerships and stuff like that and I genuinely love social media I think it can be a dark place but God called me to be a light my work schedule is really weird because technically like you don't ever really get a day off because the whole point is creating content and just stuff like that I always like to make sure that I have like a couple rest days so Monday and Tuesdays are kind of like my chill days where I'm just getting like back on track with everything because the weekends are always crazy I'm usually doing orders or something like that with my little side baking thing and then um yeah so mother's day weekend just happened and it was such a successful sale and everything but i'm very worn out plus church plus filming editing i'm gonna go home shower get ready and then i'm meeting my friend I actually met in a kroger parking lot this kroger's parking lot i met her because god told her to come up to me and this was when i was like 18 and some like bad stuff really bad stuff happened in my life so i'm gonna go meet her and we've been friends ever since so yeah, we try to meet like once a month. I'm having a small snack before I go meet her at lunch. I had a couple of these. I don't know, I was just kind of craving a little, you know what I'm talking about. I have a protein shake. My face feels so dry right now. I'm just gonna put my favorite moisturizer on there. Brand new, never been used. This stuff is so hydrating. I know it's for your body, but my skin, my face is so dry, like flaky. I put this on in the morning and at night. So that's all I'm gonna do for like makeup. I put contacts in and then I'm gonna put my hair down. Okay, there's the hair look. Earrings, bigger hoops. <laughs> okay. But okay, look at this outfit. Like this top is super cute. These shorts are pretty cute with it, right? I think this is cute, right? Is it? I can't tell if these are cute or not. Maybe it's too like, I need something tighter. Like here, maybe like a jean. I don't know. This is my sweet friend, say hey. Hi. She um, tried to attack me in a Kroger's parking lot. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Got these, what are they called? Um, sprouts? Sprouts. I don't know, we got these giant baked potatoes. We got like the same thing. 
then we got this macaroni and cheese. So we're gonna talk and we're gonna hang out. Done with my little lunch. We met for like two hours. That potato thing was so freaking good. And then I'm at the gas station right now. I got me in the laundry room. And honestly, I don't wanna do anything now. I do have quite a bit of work to get done when I get back. And yeah, I gotta run to the store still. I was also thinking about dyeing my eyelashes cause I got like this dye thing to like dye my eyelashes. So I think I might do that. I'm in Dollar Tree right now getting everything for like prepping for the wedding. Um, so I got these little jars. I just wanna get stuff like each day that way I'm not stressed. So I ran to a store called Beals and I got these the long one was only 10 bucks and then this was $20. I got it for my friends, like the dessert display. I'm okay kind of stressed because I have a lot to get done. <sighs> Still, even though Tuesdays are supposed to be my kind of more relaxing days, I'm stressing out. So anyways, I have a lot to get done and still have to edit and just get back to people. So I'm just going to put my phone, whenever I feel like this, I put my phone on do not disturb and I just clean. So right now I'm going to put my phone on do not disturb. I'm going to clean because I feel like when I have like a clean space, it makes me feel better. So little mini cleaning vlog. Of a cup in this with your load, it takes a small amount. Get all my trash ready and just like take it out because I have like so much trash. This whole thing. Oh my gosh, that is so hard. I gotta take all this trash out to my car and then I gotta take it to the dumpster. So that's the only sucks you gotta put it all in your car which is nasty and then I can the dumpster and dump it it is 652 I feel better that I cleaned but some actual work done so that's what I'm gonna be doing I'm probably gonna do this for like an hour this is like the part I don't like doing and I put it off all day and then I stress about it okay guys got quite a bit of work done I've been munching on these sour strips I'm also kind of doing like a what I eat in the day mm. But guess what I'm about to do? I'm about to dye my eyelashes. I just want them to be a little more umph, you know what I mean? Without having to put mascara on. And if I go blind, just put the dye on. And I gotta leave it on for another four minutes. Basically all I did, it came with uh, a little kit off of Amazon. It came with this little mixing dish and you put this dye, it's called Reficado Girl, I don't know what it is. Put this, like a little dollop, and then I mixed it with the developer solution. All together, I think the whole kit was like 35 bucks, but I mixed that together and it came with like this little wand thing. I got mine in, I got mine in blue black because apparently that's like the darkest color. So I put that in mix it up put it on my eyes also the tiktok video said to put like some type of oil or, like vaseline around your eyes so it doesn't die because look like my hands immediately got like dye all over them i didn't do my bottom eyelashes because i'm like nervous like what if i don't like it and then it's too weird but we'll see i'm excited i was low-key stressing i totally forgot to like film the whole thing on like my actual camera but I filmed it like a TikTok video, so I'll also put that in here. I love doing girly things. I'm just a girl. How do I know? What if it's staining? Um, so this is crazy. Like this is nuts. I just added like a little curl to them. Guys. <gasps> I feel bonita. I feel very muy, muy, muy bonita. This is, I'm not wearing any makeup. Like, how crazy is that? Woo. <laughs> Good time in a club. Okay, so this definitely works. I'm gonna go ahead and shower, and I'm just gonna rinse off real quick because I just don't wanna go to bed without 
you know, rinsing off. So I'm going to rinse off and then I got to switch my load of laundry. Yeah. And then I think I need to eat something for dinner, but I'm really not that hungry. I might just have like a protein shake because I'm kind of low on protein right now. Only thing I don't dry are my gym clothes. I let those hang. I'm just going to hang these. Got this thing off Amazon. It's on my storefront, but it keeps it so even if people have a key, they can't get them. It is 9.33 and typically I like to stay off my phone around like 9ish and um, I'm going to have me some food. I'm going to have this little fiesta salad from Walmart. It has 11 grams of protein and then I have a protein shake. I'm also gonna start my dishwasher because I never did that. My new favorite podcast I've been listening to has been Kristen John's. That's the point with John, her best friend or whatever. Whenever I go to bed, I always put my AC on and then I bring it down to 62. I get set up for bed. I'm so glad I showered. I felt kind of gross. Setting the alarm. Yeah, let's do 5.50, be up by 6 a.m. And then be on a walk by 6.15. We do that right there. I'm going to hear my alarm sound. This is my alarm sound. Because, you know, the radar was like, ding, 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 ding. I, it gives me so much anxiety. So this, I bought this song. It's called Gentle Awakening. It's on iTunes. So that's my alarm clock because you best not wake me up with that wreck. This is my book, The Year of Jubilee. It is so good. I'm like halfway through it right now, about right there. But it's Christian fiction and it's kind of based in like the 1960s when like uh, the civil rights movement was happening. So yeah, that's kind of my night and thanks for coming along with me in my day of the life. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and comment in the comment section if you want a chance to win a Bible. Okay, bye!